Palm Springs International Film Festival Gala kicked off the 2020 award season last night. And Golden Globe nominee Jennifer Lopez was presented with the Spotlight Award by her Hustlers director, Lorene Scafaria. I'm sorry, I just, I feel a little bit like Joaquin. Like, I'm so glad to be here, but I want to run out the door. I'm so nervous. Um, thank you, Loreen, for that. That was so sweet. I can't, I'm not used to all that praise. I'm so okay. And finally, my partner in life, my love, Alex Rodriguez. He makes me feel like a winner every single day. So, win, winning. So, I love you. Um, so to all the talented women out there writing films, producing films, and directing films, support one another and, and tell your stories. And remember, no is not an answer. It's an opportunity. Thank you again so much to the Palm Springs Film Festival for this award. Thank you, good night. I love you, thank you so much. Look at her getting all emotional. I know. Also, who's not praising her People enough? People need to praise Jill She Jill said she's not more. used to yeah. this kind of praise. Every I day I would tell her, you're amazing. How you're are you doing all this, Jennifer Lopez? Yeah, she's like, she, right. she wants to thank her life partner, but clearly he's not giving her enough praise. No. Alex, get on it. Uh, Carrie says I could see her as a front runner. Uh, someone else saying she looks beautiful. Uh, yeah, it's going to be an interesting award season to see how this goes. I think she will win the Golden Globe on Sunday. Yeah, it's looking that way, isn't it? But like, because the Golden Globes, like, they're big stars. I don't know, just it's one of those roles that you think, yeah, the Golden Globes go for. The Oscars, a uh, whole other thing. It's going to be interesting. She's, but she's doing award season very, very well, I think. Yeah. Like, I don't and know if it's she not, can give a speech. Right. Like, she's great at giving and acceptance speeches. she's being so genuine about all yes. the stuff. Every nomination that she gets. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's going to be interesting. Because Laura Dern, who also won an award last night, I think she got, like, a Lifetime Achievement Award, which is kind of weird. What is um, the trophy? What is that? Is it, a, I don't know. Is so it like a gesture? These, I mean, these awards are completely made up. Like, let's be real. I don't know what like, that is. I'm curious This about isn't, it. like, by, by committee. Me. It's literally just, like, they're going to give awards to certain people. Like, this was a spotlight award that Jennifer yes. Lopez got. Yeah, Laura Dern got a Career Achievement Award. There's, like, Renee Zellberger got one. Feel, Jamie Foxx got one. Adam Driver got one. It's, it's all, so they're kind of made up. It's all in the campaigning for the bigger awards. Right. Right? You, you get that person's name and face out there. They give the good speech. Again, like, yeah, like another great. moment, yeah. A, a, another fantastic moment, and it kind of like puts that person in mind when it comes to the bigger awards like this this weekend. Yeah, Gail says well deserved. Yeah, Wingstorm says hopefully J Lo wins the Oscar. Yeah, so I was gonna say it's gonna be her versus Laura Dern. That's gonna yeah. be a huge showdown. And Laura Dern's never won an Oscar. She's great in Marriage Story. So yeah, it's gonna she be is interesting. She's so good in Marriage Story. It's gonna be Story. interesting showdown. But yeah, yeah. Jennifer Lopez is definitely gonna be nominated for an Oscar. But yeah, we'll see how it plays out. But I think she's in good shape for the Golden Globe. Yeah. We'll see.